Hi everyone, it's Nainan here at Analytics Studio. Welcome back. So today we want to discuss how to deal with roofs, especially because of how they currently look like. It is generally because of the floor plan cut plane. And what do I mean by a floor plan cut plane? If we go to document and we go to floor plan cut plane, you can see that we have a blue line somewhere here and they are telling us it's one meter from the ground, 1.1. So if we increase the height of that, it should show on the roof itself. So let's try to make it something like three meters from the ground. If I say OK, you can see that instantly we have a normal roof. But then, of course, because we still have some more space left up here, it's not complete that's one way you can solve the problem is by increasing that height but the problem is that change is global and it affects everything else what do I mean if we go to the ground floor for example and we look at something like this there you can see that it has changed the cut plane to somewhere here but if we take it back if I go back to document and I say floor plan cut plane and we have it at 1.1, you should see what I mean. The fact that it's showing us the cutting plane is supposed to be at this area. So you want to be careful with changing the height of that floor plan cut plane. So what is a good solution for the problem? Because we definitely have lost what we had accomplished so what we want to do is to select the roof and under settings which you can go by Control t or somewhere here click on this icon we have here something that we call floor plan display so currently it is projected with overhead so you want to change that from that to outline only so that is going to allow us to see the whole roof in its glory so if we say okay you can see that that has been fixed but there's a problem if we go to the first floor you can see that we have created ourselves a huge dilemma because that roof has been made so also on the other floor plans so what we want to actually do is to make sure that this roof appears only on the roof plan but does not appear on the first floor so how do we do that we have to go back to the settings and we want to make sure that right here under show on all st on stories we want it not to show on all relevant stories so we want to change this to home story only but we can't stop here because currently it is being placed on the first floor which is not what we want because remember the roof is supposed to be on the roof plan not on the first floor so you want to go ahead and change that to the roof plan so right now we should have this disappear in this area so that you can see we get a warning that this has been moved to the floor plan here which is what we want so we say okay and we can see that it no longer appears here and it just appears in this place just one more thing that we need to to fix is that once we do that if i can go in any of the views for example on this section you can see the roof has moved all the way up and that's because of the height that it is being placed at if i select this you can see that it is three meters or something uh, above the the actual level of the roof plan so we want to bring that down by the roof height that we by the fl floor height that we chose in this case i'm using 3.2 as the floor height so i'm going to move this roof down to its place by 3.2 and now everything should be all right which is looking pretty cool so we have ourselves a beautiful section and if we go back here on the on the roof plan we have a clean representation of the roof and as well on the first floor we do not have any of those things that are all over the place which is which is what we were trying to achieve so finally how do we improve how do we improve the look of this thing so first of all you could affect the lines by going to settings look for something called uncut line and then you can in 
increase the pin here I can see here I have uncut pin so this I can change it to the 0.35 I think that would look cool so if I click on the outside you can see that that's a bit more better in terms of the lines that have been shown or you could use a graphic override so if you haven't watched the video before I recommend that you do go and watch that one so that's it for today thanks so much for watching and I will see you soon